bought for $7.99, sold for a best offer of $400 within a few weeks. Hey, Bolo Buddies. Thanks for watching. Hi, welcome to my channel. We are going to talk about Bolo's items to be on the lookout for. <laughs> <laughs> items you can hopefully buy low and flip for a profit. I'm going to tell you where they got it, what they paid for it, and what it sold for. And let's talk about my Facebook group, Share a Bolo. In my Facebook group, you will find a share post at the top under the featured section announcements. And if you're not in the group, under my link tree down below, you will find a link to the Facebook group. Just join it, share a Bolo, and I'll feature it in a video like this. Be sure to shout yourself out in all the places in the comment and I will talk about it in the video when I share your bolo. So this one says, hi Courtney, I paid 40 for this neon beer sign at a local flea market, sold for $279 plus shipping, shipped FedEx and just got around $30. I got hacked on Facebook, they changed, what? They changed my last name to don't have one. I had to change password but can't change my name back for 60 days. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what is she talking about? Oh my goodness. Somebody hacked her and changed her name on Facebook to don't have one. That is hilarious. How did they do that? Is it somebody you know? Oh my goodness. I'm talking to her like she can hear me. If you're watching, how did they do that? I, I don't understand. Did somebody get like in your family do it as a joke? All right, so there it is. It's a vintage Killian's Irish Red Beer neon sign. The next one is this uh, typewriter. It's portable, guys. Vintage typewriters will sell some for more than others. I told I sold two this week. First for eighty, an eighties model for forty. This older one sold for one ten in about a day. Sourced it through a private pick where I paid sixty for several items. I doubled my money on my first sale, so this was pure profit. Thanks, Courtney. Love the group and your YouTube. Oh, thank you. This comes from the dog patch picker. And I will say that I sold a typewriter once and I don't know that I'll ever do it again. But this one has a case. So if it has a case, I'd probably do it. But I had to ship one without a case and it was not fun. Not fun at all. Daisy Kingdom Scotty Fabrics and Simplicity Pattern. Uncut, which means it has not been cut, guys. She said, I got 11 large boxes of various craft supplies for free on the sidewalk two summers ago. I was stunned when I opened one box to find it was all Daisy Kingdom fabric and matching patterns. I listed the first lot last month and it sold very quickly for asking of $44.95 plus shipping. Yeah, Daisy Kingdom, especially, oh man, the pattern. Oh, I, I'd be pricing that high. Wow, the pattern and the exact matching fabric. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Why don't you try an auction if you have more of these? Start them high and see what happens, honey. That some of that Daisy Kingdom can go for big bucks. And I know it probably depends on the pattern. And I'm sure you did your research, but whoo, nice pickup. Crocodile Creek come along Daisy Yellow Duck stuffed. Paid two for this Crocodile Creek plush at a thrift store. It sold in just a few days for full asking of $39.95 plus shipping. Oh, isn't he cute? I've never seen him before. I love selling plush. Here we go. Horror VHS Night of the Living Dead Vintage Videotape Network Extremely Rare. Look at this tape, you guys. Look at it. That is crazy, right? Bought this one at the Goodwill Bins for 50 cents and sold it for $299.99. If you like vintage t-shirts, clothing, and jerseys, you can find me on eBay, Mercari, and Depop as Train Rider Ben. There you go, guys. Oh, I've got it there twice. Whoops. Okay. Lot of seven Throne of Glass series, Sarah J. Mass original covers. I think these are books. Um, sold for $139 there, guys. $139. The next one, this is the same seller, A Court of Wings and Ruin, paperback book, Sarah Mass. So Sarah Mass, I've never heard of Sarah Mass, but apparently she's a bolo book. $39.99 on that one. This one is same author, sold for $59.99. Huh. Interesting. 
And they said, purchased all the above books for $10, the ones that sold above, or that I just showed you. They all sold within days. This was a few weeks back. I just found similar lot again this week at the local flea market. And this is a flea market picture, I think, of the ones they just found. Huh, those are thick, big books. Wow. This one just caught me off guard. Wool and Prince. Wool and Prince? Crew neck t-shirt. Murano wool red burgundy. So I, I don't know if it's the brand or if somebody just needed this color of shirt. It says found at the bins for $1.50 approximately. Sold within a day, within a few hours for $38 internationally. So not only did they pay $38, but they also have international fees and shipping. So I don't know what's special about that, but apparently it's special. They wanted it in another country. Brunello Cusinelli blazer, men's size 54 and 44 in parentheses. Bought for $7.99, sold for a best offer of $400 within a few weeks. Wow. Wow, wow. So I'm guessing Brunello Cusinelli is a high dollar uh, clothing brand. I don't know. Anybody ever sell it? That, that was a quick sell. What'd she say? Within a couple weeks? Eight bucks into $400. Hmm. All right, guys. So a lot of interesting ones in here. A lot of books, that VHS. Let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite. And if anybody is a specialist in Daisy Kingdom, let me know if you think she should price that higher. Uh, seems so vintage. If you're watching, you'd be a good person to ask. You know your stuff about fabric. You guys follow Seems So Vintage on um, Whatnot. She is the one that makes my cool hats that I wear. And speaking of whatnot, look at this necklace. Oh, this is like glass or something. Isn't this cool? Guess where I'm going to sell it? On whatnot. And I'm going to start it at $5. It's so cool, isn't it? I love it. I think it's glass. Isn't it gorgeous? It's gorgeous. Who's going to get it? Are you going to get it? Use my referral link down below. You'll get $15 to shop if you join whatnot with that. And um, I'm Bolo Buddies over there. And I do a lot of untangling jewelry. Everything starts at $5 or less. And all the videos that I've been making, I'm wearing jewelry. I've got it all right here in a pile. And I'm going to sell those at my whatnot show. So um, if you liked it, you can come bid on it. All right. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you all. Thank you to everybody that shared. Um, if you have never shared a bolo, come share one. Also, if you want to do a, this is my bolo video, 60 second video telling me this is my bolo and you hold it up and you say, I sold this for blank. I got it at blank. And um, tell me where you got it, what you paid for it and what it sold for and shout out your YouTube channel or whatever in the video. And I will put your video in my video. And it's a great way to get exposure for your social media, Instagram, TikTok, whatnot, YouTube, where you sell, all that. Put it in the video. And people get to see you. They get to know your personality. And then if you're on YouTube or whatnot, they may come watch you. Oh. <gasps> All right, you guys. Thanks again. I appreciate y'all. Um, see you soon. Come hang out. Check out the uh, description of the video. And thanks for watching.